So one of the things you want to make sure you do when you set up a new WordPress site is to go to the settings. So you click the settings here and you just want to make sure um, everything's good and ready to go. So the tagline by default is just another WordPress site. We'll just delete that for now. It's, uh, it's not necessary for us. So save changes. Go into writing settings and make sure everything looks good. So this is okay here. Um, the sort of defaults are set, so if you, if you want to change those, um, you can. Uh, the the uh, update service by default is Pingomatic. You can add a bunch of uh, different different sites here if you want your posts to be pinged um, more to to a larger a larger group of sites. But I personally don't think it's necessary, so I'm okay with the writing settings. So the front page, whether or not it displays your latest post or a static page, so this is all good for me. The discussion tab, so these are sort of all the factors um, based on your comments, right? You can also do moderation and uh, anytime a comment contains a certain word, you can, um, you, can, you can ban it or blacklist people. Avatars, the default avatar, I like Gravatar. Um, as opposed to anything else, so that's okay for me there. Then we'll go to media. Everything here is okay for me. No big deal. Privacy. Um, you want to, as long as you're trying to get found, you want to make sure this is checked, right? If you ask search engines not to index the site, um, that's no good. But it's good by default. And then this is the most important piece, the permalinks. So by default, this will make your posts kind of an ugly URL. Appforce.co slash question mark post P equals post number. You always want to change this to post name. Right, so this gives you a much cleaner SEO friendly URL structure. And just click save. And we are good to go.